here and ready. We'll take place. place. But in the meantime, here's what you need to know so you don't miss even one second from your favorite television program. A lot has changed since RCA introduced television in this 1939 company video. First black and white, then color in the late 60s. And until a few years ago, television stations only transmitted analog signals using radio waves. Right now, stations, including ABC7, also transmit a digital signal, which is a series of zeros and ones. But next February, the analog signal of TV broadcasters will go away, leaving only the digital signal. To make sure you're ready for this change, ABC7 plans to do a test at 5.28 p.m. today. If you are ready for digital, then you'll continue to see ABC7, no problem. If, however, you are watching over the air and you are not ready for the DTV transition, that is, you're just watching a conventional analog over the air set, you're going to get a special message that's going to alert you to the fact that you are watching only analog and it's going to provide you some phone numbers and some information about what you might do in order to get ready. And you're not ready if you're using a rabbit ears antenna or a rooftop antenna connected to an older TV set. So what you're watching right now will go away today at 5.28 p.m. and in February unless you make a change. As soon as we get the transition to Anima TV, you are going to see snow. Uh, there's not going to be a picture there. To receive digital broadcast signals, your TV must be equipped with a digital tuner. Most new TV sets sold since March of last year have one built in already, so they're ready to go. If you're a cable or satellite customer, you're ready to go as well. But if you're not connected to a cable or satellite and your TV isn't digital ready, you must buy one of these. A digital converter box connected to a good VHF, UHF antenna. This is a positive thing. When we're digital, you will get better pictures and better sound. It's going to be a great improvement. Again, that test is going to take place today at exactly 5.28 p.m. It's going to last for two minutes. Now, I mentioned a countdown clock we're going to put at the bottom of the screen so you know exactly when this is going to take place. And that countdown clock starts right now. It's there. Okay, well, it looks like we've got about a minute and five, five seconds. seconds. Minute five, five, minutes. Sorry, five, sorry, five, five minutes. Sorry, an hour and five minutes before we come back to that test. So, so I'll see you I'll then. I'll see you then. Reporting live from Burbank, this is Ripper Girl, ABC7 Eyewitness News.